Today I'm going to go over which prop is right for your boat. Uh, now it's been a couple years since we made one of these videos and we've got a few more props and different models and sizes. Uh, so I just kind of wanted to go over that today. Um, let's get right to it. Uh, the first thing I want to talk about is the fundamental difference between a three blade and a two blade. Uh, three blades you're going to find on most manufacturers uh, motors right from the factory, OEM. Um, a big reason for that is vibration. Uh, the three blade is always going to have less vibration than a two blade. Uh, odd number of blades means less vibration. Um, the, the advantage you get with a three blade, again, vibration, uh, and they're just smoother to run. Um, a lot of times they're better in reverse. Uh, they do very, very well in uh, a little bit deeper water, you know, above 12 inches, uh, vegetation, uh, stumps, rocks, things like that. They excel. They do very well. Uh, so for the three blades, we've got the, the old original Merc three blade. Uh, my buddy first came out with this prop. It's been uh, 15 years ago or so. Uh, this is a, a favorite among guys that do uh, lots of modifications. Um, guys that have lots of power, uh, you know, 60 horsepower and above love this prop. Um, there seems to be a lot of guys that will get these uh, changed, uh, different pitch, different cup, and, uh, you know, Sometimes this ends up being the very fastest prop, depending on your boat. Um, now the other one is a newer model that we've got is the Raptor. Uh, this is actually the Raptor 2. Uh, this is the second generation of Raptor. Uh, you can see it's a little bit different than the three blade. It's got the, the pointy ears. Um, it's, it's a very thick prop, uh, heavy hub. Uh, this is what Mudbuddy puts on their motors from the factory. Uh, very, very good top speed prop. Uh, very good in uh, vegetation, stumps, uh, a little bit deeper water. Now, the, the, the difference between any three blade to any two blade is shallow water. Two blades always perform better in very, very shallow water and soupy mud. Um, you know, sandy bottoms, things like that, where you have to go from a dead stop to get up on plane quickly. A two blade is going to pop you up on plane quicker. Um, the disadvantage is vibration. They, they tend to vibrate a little bit more than a three blade does. Uh, if, you, if your motor is prone to vibration problems like cracking mufflers or um, you know, little brackets and pieces that, that crack, uh, bolts that, that come loose, things like that, uh, you may want to look at the three blade. But um, two blades what I usually have on my boat and I'll kind of go over those, those options right here. Um, I'm going to start with the smallest horsepower, smallest size model, and that's our 11 by 10. You'll find these on a Mud Buddy 23 on the, either the minis or the sports, HDRs, whatever. Um, these fit great on 23s or the color 25s. Um, these will fit on a bunch of different manufacturers, Mud Buddy, uh, Gator Tail. They'll fit on uh, some Copperheads, I believe, uh, three-quarter hex. These are all three-quarter hex props here, so that's all we'll be talking about today. Uh, this is a, a very good prop for the smaller horsepower motors, 23s, 25s. Um, the next is our uh, old standard big blade. This is the big blade prop. It's 12 and a quarter by 10. Uh, it, this is the very best all around prop. Uh, when somebody calls me and says, you know, I want a prop that is that, that, that good at everything. Uh, very shallow water, top speed, uh, mid range, pushing a load, the big blade. Uh, we sell more of the, we probably sell two to one, everything else on the table combined of these big blades. Um, they last forever, they, they do not break, they're, they're just an amazing prop. Um, the next one is going to be a, a new model for us and that's what we call our power blade. Uh, they're, this, the, the, the power blade is actually 12 and 3 quarter by 10, so it's just a little bit more diameter than the big blade. Um, the blades are quite a bit thinner than the big blade. So what that means is you can usually get more RPMs out of this prop. Uh, you know, compared to the big blade, this is probably going to be a little bit faster on the top end. Uh, the, the downside to this prop is it is a little bit thinner. So if you're running in sh uh, really shallow, sandy areas, rocks, things like that, uh, this tends to wear out a little bit thick, uh, faster than the big blade does. Um, but that's what lends it to be a little bit faster is the blades are thinner. Great prop, um, very quick, pushes the load very well. Uh, awesome, awesome prop. Uh, the next is the hammer prop. Uh, this is the very best at pushing a load. Um, 
this is going to bring your RPMs down because it's a lot bigger. Um, it's actually a 12 and three quarter by 11. So uh, guys that have um, motors that are uh, stage one and higher, you know, muffler, carb kit, cylinder heads, or the, uh, the fuel injected models that have cylinder heads, mufflers, you know, 45 horsepower and above typically it takes to, to push this prop. Uh, when somebody calls us and asks us, is a hammer going to work on my boat? Basically what I'll say is, how many RPMs does your stock prop spin with an empty boat and wide open, as fast as you'll go? Uh, if you can spin your stock big blade or Raptor at uh, above 4,200 RPMs, you can probably push a hammer. Um, this is going to slow down your top speed by a mile an hour, maybe two miles an hour. But what this does is get you up on plane very fast, um, which you know is going to make your prop last longer. You're not trudging through the mud and sand and things like that forever. Um, thick blade, get you up on plane very fast, pushes the load very well. Um, so those are kind of our, uh, our options that we've got right now. These will work for uh, Mud Buddy. Um, and if you want, you can actually order the uh, hub machine for the XD models. Um, if you're on our website, you can just click on the box that says XD. Um, you'll see that this is machined a little bit differently here than one of these props. Uh, this is to fit into the XD hub. Uh, now, I don't know how many calls I've had where guys will get this prop, they order it, it comes in the mail, they call me up and say, this is, this is uh, for a Mud Buddy. It says Mud Buddy on it, and it looks different than my XD prop. Um, that's just because we don't have enough meat on the outside diameter here to put the outer ring in that hub. So it works perfectly fine. We've sold thousands and thousands of these just like this. Works great. Okay, let's say you've got um, a favorite prop or you've got, you want to order Mud Buddy props without the XD. We've also got these adapters that you can get. Basically, this is going to go on your shaft before the prop and it will accept uh, a Mud Buddy prop on an XD lower unit. Um, if you have any more questions, give us a call 385 695 3807 or send an email to travis at backwater.com, uh, backwaterperformance.com, and uh, let us know.